that more and more employers are getting involved with supported internships and more and more families and young people are hearing about supported internships because it's a brilliant opportunity to help support young people with a learning disability into the world of work. You'll always get a loyal employee from a learner who has needs because they're given their opportunities to shine and they put themselves in that position and all they want is to succeed at the end. It's massive personal satisfaction to help these young adults to grow with their independence, to see their confidence grow, to see their communication skills grow, to then at the end to potentially getting paid work. It's a fantastic risk-free way of looking at a new talent and uh, helping people that maybe need a little bit of help in life. So um, from our perspective as an employer, it's, it's been seamless and incredibly valuable, so couldn't recommend it enough. I have additional needs, um, so with my supported internship, it's definitely been the right programme for me. I've learnt loads, it's definitely up to my IT skills. I've enjoyed everything, it is the best thing I've done. I enjoy getting some new skills and gaining more experience and working with people. It's just brilliant. I've become more and more independently. program isn't about work experience, it is about learning real skills for a real job. The biggest thing that we look for in any intern coming onto the program is that they want to work, but they need support to make that transition from education into paid work. It's all about finding the right work placement for the right young person. What we have is we have a program that is in place for young learners who have an educational healthcare plan in place. So they're working in real work time, they're developing their skills, their knowledge, learning a trade, learning a job role. So every young person who comes on the programme has a job coach that will help support them to help them to develop their skills and their independence in the workplace. Job coach is hugely, hugely important to the success of the supported internship. The job coach will break down the tasks for the intern, they will learn the tasks and they do what's called a task analysis. They will then help train and teach the intern how to do that particular role, offering 100% support to begin with and then fading that support throughout the supported internship until they're working totally independently. So William travels independently and William will walk from home to the bus stop, catch a bus to Nantwich bus station and then walk to uh, Everybody Leisure and William will book in himself. A typical day for William would be really dealing with the clients of Everybody Leisure. So I work on the reception, cafe, doing them cleaning, duty manager and help and fitness advisor. He's really gained sort of just his own little place here and he's loved working and meeting all the people. So he's always telling everybody about it. So he's gained in his confidence totally. He's gained in um, what he does and how it works his whole week uh, around coming to work. Amy, real inspiration, I have to say. And although she's an intern, I think it's important to probably say that really she, she's a real key member of the team and always has been since she started. And that's been part of her success that she's just got stuck in and got involved from, from day one, really. The impact on Amy has been amazing. When I first started with Amy back in September, Amy was very quiet and shy. Amy has progressed so much to the point she is now assisting the pastry chef with making scones and cutting up the sandwiches for the afternoon tea. I uh, go on with Amy to do some baking stuff. I went out to the ingredients, had to mix all together with the mixing machines. 
and to get them out to roll it, use a rolling pin, and use the cutters and just put put on the tray to set to, to bake it. Yes, I really enjoyed internships. Yes, I love to work with Cool Hall and letting new people that so I get a little bit of confidence. Charlotte grow in confidence. When I first met her, she wasn't independent getting a bus. She can travel by herself now. She's using those skills in everyday life as well. She's grown so much confidence. She's able to complete tasks independently now and it's just made me so proud. I think it set Charlotte up for the future because she's now transferring the skills that she's learned into all her other placements. So obviously me having additional needs, um, I've had to adapt with a job coach to how I do work, things at work. Obviously when I'm told something, I don't necessarily take in all that information, I only process some of it. So in terms this helps me to break down the tasks I've got to do and then it means that I know exactly what I've got to do and it makes it a lot easier for me to do that, ta uh, that certain task. No task is too big for her and no task is too small. She's really enthusiastic with the work that we give her. It's a great opportunity for the student and it's a great opportunity for you as an employer as well. From our point of view, we've, we've had an extra member of the team come in one day a week and really help with all of the tasks that we've got.